So today I'm gonna be giving you an optimization guide to get maximum out of your PC. And if this video helps you by any chance, make sure to drop me a sub and let's get right into it. Okay, so the first step is you need to right click on your Windows button, click on Run, search MS Config, and then Enter, and then go in Boot, Advanced Options, Number of Processors. Select the maximum you have. You maybe have 16 or 8. I have 4, so I'm gonna select 4. Okay apply okay and then restart your pc you'll be good to go so after restarting you need to click on this pc then right click properties and then advanced system settings and then click on advanced settings and then adjust for best performance and then enable four of these and okay okay and step two is done so for the step three you need to open settings after opening settings click on gaming and then disable game bar and after that click on game mode and on the game mode and then click on graphic settings after opening it you need to add any game you play okay for the reference i'm gonna be adding fortnite then double click and then click on options and high performance and if you see a hardware acceleration thing here on it and then restart your pc after doing all the steps you need to open settings again and then search background apps turn off them and then search again for notifications and click and then turn off notifications too and you are done with the settings now close it so after doing all those settings you need to download the optimization pack from the description then right click extract here and then open it after opening the pack you need to create restore point and then click on configure and then select six percent and then apply and then okay it's gonna create a restore point in case you do something wrong and then click on okay after doing that you need to click on bad tweaks and double click on it right click run as admin run as admin all of these files one by one disable super fetch the useful tweaks is gonna take some time so be patient so after applying all those settings you need to go back then click on DNS jumper and then right click run as admin and then you need to click on fastest DNS and then start DNS test it's gonna find the fastest DNS for you so you don't have to and then after you find it just just click on apply close it close it and you're good with the DNS so after the DNS you need to click on NVIDIA inspector click on profile drag and drop it to the this file and then it's gonna say successfully imported click on ok and go back and then click on power plan and then right click run as admin it's gonna import the ultimate performance power plan for you and then click ok and then go back programs and then install two of these Okay, so after installing you need to you need to select the ultimate performance and then make active and then show advanced disable and set all of these 200 and disabled apply okay and it's gonna apply it for you okay so after that open process lasso then you need to click on options general and set two of these to 5s and after that you need to go to main performance mode click on enabled and then open any game you play right click set the priority to high okay after setting the priority to high you need to click on induce performance mode and you're good to go with the process as well. and then close it it's gonna run in the background so let it run it's not gonna take up your system resources it's just an advanced task manager okay after the programs you need to go back registry optimizations 
and then okay after applying all of those you need to go back again and then right click on ms utility v3 run as admin and then you need to select everything that says msi select everything that says msi and then don't set anything too high it's gonna make your fps slightly worse then click on apply close it after that you're done with all of these settings then move on to paging file then double click on it and you're gonna see some values don't worry double click on this pc right click properties advanced system settings advanced settings then you need to click advanced again change and then put whatever amount of ram you have if you have four you need to put this both of them in both of these it's gonna say no paging file for you just click on custom size and then put, then put the amount of ram you have installed and then click ok ok and then click on remote and don't allow remote connections to this computer and uncheck this and then click ok and restart your pc i hope this video helped for you if it did then make sure to like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one goodbye